Have you ever stopped to admire a rainbow arcing across the sky after a refreshing rainstorm? It's a truly magical sight, isn't it? That's nature's very own color show, a dazzling display painted across the heavens. Our world is absolutely bursting with color. It's everywhere we look, from vibrant reds to sunny yellows to calming blues and every single shade and hue in between. Colors make our world so much more exciting and interesting, don't they? They help us describe the things we love and cherish, like a bright yellow toy truck that zooms across the floor, or a shiny blue bicycle that takes us on amazing adventures. They're also a kind of secret language, a visual code that helps us navigate the world. Colors are useful for helping us spot our favorite cereal on a crowded store shelf, and to know exactly when it's safe to cross the street at a busy intersection. They even help animals either hide from predators with camouflage or stand out to attract a mate. Today, we're going to become color scientists ourselves, ready to explore the magic of color. And we're going to turn your very own kitchen into a fantastic science lab. We'll be using simple things that you probably already have, like ordinary water, absorbent paper towels to clean up any spills, and of course, vibrant and exciting food coloring. So get ready to mix different colors together, carefully pour liquids from one container to another, and watch in amazement as colors travel and beautifully blend right before your very eyes. By the end of our experiment, you'll see just how science can make the world around us even more incredible and fascinating. So let's dive right in and start our amazing and colorful adventure together. Have you ever stopped to wonder what are colors really? It's all about light. The very essence of color lies within the radiant energy that illuminates our world. Sunlight looks white, but it's actually a mix of all the rainbow's colors, a beautiful spectrum hidden in plain sight. It's a symphony of hues waiting to be revealed. Each color is a different kind of light wave, a unique frequency dancing through space. Red has long waves, stretching out like a lazy river, while blue has short ones, zipping by with energy. When light hits an object, like a red apple, a fascinating interaction occurs. The apple absorbs all colors except red, which bounces back to your eyes, creating the vibrant image you perceive. That's why a green frog looks green. It reflects green light and absorbs the rest, a clever trick of nature's palette. Animals and plants use color to hide, attract friends, or stand out. It's a visual language spoken across the natural world like parrots flaunting their vibrant plumage, or flowers beckoning pollinators with their irresistible hues. Even the blue sky is a trick of light waves scattering in the air, a phenomenon known as Rayleigh scattering. So next time you see a pumpkin or a field of grass, take a moment to appreciate the science behind the spectacle. Remember, it's all about which colors bounce back to you, painting the world in its diverse shades. Color is nature's way of communicating, a silent dialogue expressed through light and reflection. The science of light makes our world a non-stop color show, a dazzling display of physics and beauty unfolding before our very eyes. Ready for our first experiment? It's a fun one that combines a bit of magic with science. Let's make water walk and mix colors. We're going to defy gravity and create a beautiful rainbow effect right before your eyes. To get started, You'll need seven clear cups. Make sure they're all the same size for the best results. Water, of course. Tap water is just fine for this experiment. Paper towels, which will act as our bridges for the water to travel. And red, yellow, and blue food coloring, the primary colors that will allow us to create a spectrum of new colors. Now, line up the cups in a straight row, leaving a little space between each one. Fill the first, third, fifth, and seventh with water about halfway full. Leave the others empty. These are where our new colors will magically appear. Add red food coloring to the first and seventh cups. A few drops should do the trick. Then add yellow food coloring to the third cup. And finally, add blue food coloring to the fifth cup. Fold six paper towel strips lengthwise. This will make them strong enough to act as our bridges. Now, bridge each cup to its neighbor with a paper towel strip creating a little paper towel arch. Watch closely as the colored water climbs the paper towels. This is called capillary action, a process where liquid flows in narrow spaces without the assistance of gravity. 
It's the same process trees use to move water from their roots all the way up to their leaves. As the red and yellow water meet in the empty cup, you'll see the vibrant color orange magically appear. And where yellow and blue meet, you'll see green being created. You're seeing colors travel, mix, and blend right before your eyes, creating a beautiful spectrum. It's just like the amazing color gradients we see in nature, like in a sunset or a rainbow. It's simple science, but the results are truly amazing and beautiful to watch. Now that you've seen how it works, what new and exciting colors can you create with your walking water experiment? Now let's see how all the rainbow's colors can mix back into white. Make a color wheel. Cut a circle from cardboard or use a paper plate. Divide it into seven sections and color each with a rainbow color. Spin your wheel using a pencil or string. As it spins, the colors blur together and the wheel looks white or grayish white. That's because your eyes can't keep up, so they blend the colors into white, just like sunlight. This simple trick shows how all colors combine to make light. Science and art spinning together, binning. Today we explored the science behind every color we see. We learned that objects reflect certain light waves, creating the colors all around us. Our experiments showed how colors mix and how our eyes blend them back into white. Nature uses color for camouflage, attraction, and beauty, from rainbows to peacocks. Now you're a colorologist. Keep exploring, mix paints, look for colors in nature, and ask questions. Why is the ocean blue? How do leaves change color? The world is your laboratory full of colorful secrets. Stay curious and keep discovering the magic of color.